Warning, the following video contains scenes of a sexual nature that may offend some viewers as we check out six lewd video game easter eggs and secrets. The first easter egg on the list lays with Resident Evil 4, where after defeating the lake monster, battering the giant to death and heading to the church in chapter 2-1, Leon will be able to unlock a sealed chamber where the former president's daughter Ashley is being held. Ashley! Don't come! <laughs> but that's not a problem because Captain Pervert has come to the rescue, and by leading Ashley to a nearby ladder, Leon is meant to drop down and catch her. But instead, and in this case, he decides to check out the ladder just to make sure it's safe. Oh, you pervert. Hey, what are you looking at? Oh, you pervert. Hey, what are you looking at? Oh, you pervert. Moving on, and here's the third installment to the Twisted Metal series, all thanks to 989 Studios where as per usual various drivers take hold of their modified vehicles in a bid to beat Calypso's competition by basically not dying while everyone else burns in a blaze of glory. Ah! Lovely. Anyway, one of the newest contestants on the scene is Amber Rose and by viewing her profile you can get to know her a little better. That's all cool and everything, but if you want a different view of Amber, then enter left square 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 left into the password screen. This next one I have to say completely caught me by surprise and I have played many point and click adventures in the past and seen many easter eggs, but the one you are about to witness in the 2012 edition to the Dark Eye series is a real what the f moment. I mean who would have thought that rubbing a puppet head filled with magnesium against the curtain would lead to such an act. Say anything. I know. Mary, I. I just want you to think of me. Okay then, so what now? Well, let's look in on SNK's Fatal Fury series, specifically Real Bout Fatal Fury, released back in 1995, where by opting for Blue Mary as a character, you would need to battle against an opponent upon the Sound Beach stage, and then send them crashing out of bounds with Mary in tow, to which, and as long as you were playing the Neo Geo port, Mary's top would pop off. And well, you know what that means. Throughout the tanker chapter in Metal Gear Solid 2, there are a vast quantity of easter eggs, most of which are rather naughty, and a handful of those are located upon Deck A crew quarters, where there are a number of lockers, two of which are home to posters of scantily dressed women. From here, it wouldn't be a bad idea to take photos of them for later on. And while we're here, we might as well also get in the lockers, since Snake can kiss them. Touch them by wielding a gun. Or touch 
them somewhere else, though that's not advised. However, it is funny to watch the guards storming in and then admiring one of the posters. Then on the way to taking photos of Metal Gear, it's in hole 2 that unknowingly we can interact with a projector. The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world order. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. Some say that the strategic importance of aircraft carriers will be reduced by the completion of raids. The opposition from the Navy is an undeniable fact. There is a lot of pressure from Navy brass, especially those with submarine and air background. Not to mention interference from a major plane. But this project is vital to the Marine Corps. The enemy is sometimes closer to home than you think, gentlemen. Always bear that in mind. Ours is not the only military project devoted to Metal Gear development. Then in Hold Free, upload all your snaps for some amusing reactions. Okay, what am I seeing now? Oh, this is a... What? Nothing. It's nothing. Uh, but this isn't a photo of Metal Gear anyway. Sorry, but you're gonna have to go back and shoot another set. I'll just make a backup of this one. And the next one is... More of these? Is that all you think about? Hey, what you like is your business. Just get those Metal Gear pictures. I'll just make a backup of this one. The following footage you are about to see is all courtesy of Seb, who runs the channel Half Blind Gamer, and has been a part of YouTube and the gaming community providing entertaining reviews and let's plays since 2008. Not only did he provide me with the necessary Easter egg footage, but went above and beyond to provide me every level, music, and basically everything to do with The Apprentice, a game that was only released on the Philips CDI in 1994, and it's home to many secrets that actually went undiscovered for years. So with that, please give thanks to Seb and check out his channel. So to witness these final secrets, firstly, you will need a game over. It is then when you must quickly hold down two on the control pad, and then inputs the following button combinations before Marvin stops walking, which will provide you with five nudalities, a reference to Mortal Kombat, except you never saw anything quite like this. Mm -hmm.